Pussycat, on the top of the European charts for nearly a decade. This is the story of their lives after the big stage. I uh, come here uh, regularly because uh, we have two grandchildren. In the morning we can do nothing, so we come here and feed the ducks. Um, the meaning in my life, most of all my children and my granddaughter, my animals, my relatives, and my work. And lovers found the place they like to be. How many times While Betty likes it quiet, Marianne is soon starting a just for fun blues band. Tony is still working as a singer mainly in Germany, and all three are still recognized by their fans. Um, if I hear our music today, yeah, Mississippi, I'm so used, they always play Mississippi. And uh, I'm really pleased when they sometimes play another of our songs. So, but it's still nice to hear, and they play them a lot. I was, I think, 32 here, 32, yeah. And this? Every day, the three sisters meet at Marianne's Café. And sometimes they dive into the memories of the past. Uh, uh, two performances I remember very well. Once, one in Flensburg, we had an audition that was fantastic. Standing ovation for maybe a quarter of an hour. And the last time, that was in the 19th, in uh, Berlin, in the uh, open air, like this, but much bigger. So many people, I got dizzy when they moved. was when we became uh, number one in uh, Great Britain. So we were very proud then, and so was the record company. That was the most memorable moment, I think. I, for me, the nicest memories in the band were the recording sessions. And on stage, of course, making music on stage. That is uh, yeah, what we already did before we were known, and we always liked that. Their lives on the big stages are a thing of the past. But Mississippi will roll along until the end of time. Why we quit it in the mid 80s? That was because we were singing together for, uh, I think, about 30 years already. And uh, our records stopped uh, becoming hits and we didn't have w uh, much work anymore, and so we called it quits. Come together with our youngest. We still have one more sister, a younger one, and so we go uh, every morning at 10 o'clock. We go there for a coffee. 
like we used to do with our mother when she still was alive. So, uh, no, and then maybe, uh, maybe, who knows, in some time we do something, something again together, only for fun.